What's up guys, Dutch Revolution here and this is Hitman Contracts Mission Number 1, Asylum. So at first you want to grab that key from the doctor we just killed, which I believe is Agent 47's dad. And you just want to keep going this way. Now the whole point of this compared to Hitman 2, Sign Assassin, where we actually have a training mission. This one here, it's kind of mixed together where you actually have the training mission along with the um, at being part of an actual mission. So just keep going here, don't worry about the uh, patients. Um, the crazies as they aren't really gonna do anything at this point because you're not in their uniform in this room we can get the syringes which is what you'll need in the next couple of missions go right through here and just keep going the way that I am actually going otherwise if you go the other way you're gonna get pretty much lost and um, you don't want to get lost in this mission so uh, this whole point of this is for agent 47 to actually escape so this is exactly what we are doing so we have a cutscene right here Okay, so just wait for the patients to get out of your way and then you can get through here and we have to take the elevator and this is the part where you actually get to choose how you would like to complete this mission. So there's actually two different ways you can actually complete it. One of them is to get the SWAT uniform and the other is to get a uh, patient uniform, which is what I did. So get the patient uniform and then go on this way. So you have a doctor down here or a staff member or whatever he's got a taser so just um, take your time I mean it's not gonna hurt your rating or anything but you don't want him zapping you and stuff like that so okay so you told us going to the left now Depending on your timing, that guard that you just saw that just went up the stairs, he only has, uh, his pattern is basically simple. He basically goes down the stairs and then he goes back up the stairs and he patrols in this little room. So his pattern is not too complicated. As a matter of fact, it's really easy to get right by him. He's not that hard to get by. So just get up against this door here and you should be good to go. Wait for him to get past you just a little bit and then just sneak right on in through here. That way he doesn't hear you and turn around because then he could end up catching you and you won't get your silent assassin. Now right here you have a guard. He patrols the outside of this car which is what we're going to use to escape. Now when he's walking around the car you do not want to go at this point because he will see you. Once he stops about right there then you can go down this ladder and you should be able to escape and you should be able to get your silent assassin so if you've done everything correctly you should have that at the end of this mission to take you no more than a little over three to four minutes depending on your timing so hopefully i was able to help you guys out with this mission and i will see you guys on the next mission